Good morning friends and welcome to this morning's Bible Reflection here in the Money Ray Mads, which I thought would be a, uh, a change of scenery for you all this morning. I'd like today to share some verses from Luke's Gospel and it's Luke chapter 8 and it is verses 1 through to 3 and the heading simply entitled Women Who Followed Jesus. Soon afterward, Jesus began a tour of the nearby towns and villages, preaching and announcing the good news about the kingdom of God. He took his 12 disciples with him, along with some women who had been cured of evil spirits and diseases. Among them were Mary Magdalene, from whom he had cast out seven demons, Joanna, the wife of Chusa, Herod's business manager, Susanna, and many others who are contributing their own resources to support Jesus and his disciples. Before we give thanks to God for our verses from Scripture, may God add his blessing to our hearing of his word. I chose that short passage just to remind us all that once again women were not peripheral to the ministry of Christ. They were and are central to Christian life and to Christian ministry. They're key witnesses to every key moment of Christ's earthly ministry. We hear a lot these days about equal opportunities employers, but the Christian church is the original equal opportunity employer. There is a place for everyone, regardless of their background, regardless as to who they are, regardless of their identity. For whoever we are, we become one through faith in Christ Jesus. And so my message this morning is simply this. Don't allow those around you to define Christianity in narrow, exclusive or intolerant ways. Remember always that Christ's disciples came from an incredible variety of backgrounds and in the same manner also Christians today come from an incredible variety of backgrounds men and women all sorts as the expression goes so today let's celebrate that radical inclusivity of the Christian faith and let's remember there is a place for everyone in God's kingdom have a really good day today, friends. Enjoy the day and please come and join us again tomorrow here at Money Ray, non-subscribing Presbyterian Church. Who knows, tomorrow they may be back here in the manse. God bless you all and Amen.